Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Faces by Emmy. I have the mom look right now. Um, I just went food shopping. I know I look rough. <laughs> um, but I do have a haul today from Aldi. I have some really cool finds. I hadn't been there in a little bit. Um, I usually shop like at Little or at Walmart. And um, they had some pretty cool things that they brought in. So I wanna share that with you all. Don't forget, if you haven't already, Please subscribe to my channel and also you can check me out on Instagram, Faces by Emmy. This is a little bit different because I usually do makeup, excuse the noise in the background, but I usually do makeup and, um, but this is also a lifestyle channel which I do have on my, my little background. <laughs> so yeah, let's get started. Alright, so I'm just going to give you guys a quick overview. It looks super cluttered, I know, but I literally got so much stuff at such a good price. Um, we have some more here. Okay, so coming over here, this is gonna be a super quick video, but I just got the, you know, some salad, some spinach, so I, I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier. I got some ahead of a cauliflower because I'm gonna be making keto mac and cheese. Um, I'm excited for that. I got some meat pasta sauces, the pasta. We got some soft chewy chocolate chip. I got some uncured beef franks. Lots of cheeses for the mac and cheese I'm making and for some other meals that I'm gonna be making throughout the week. I also, I'm gonna probably record videos on what I make for dinner a few of the nights, but I also got some tomatoes. I'm gonna be making some bruschetta. Um, I love bruschetta. I uh, got these pork rinds are gonna be the topper for the mac and cheese chips for the kids. These are for me and I'm going to show you what I'm going to be eating them with. Um, I'm going to be making some tacos. Uh, I found this little cute snack pack which like I said I thought it was super cute um, for just the days that either I'm on the go or just want to have a quick snack. I'm going to be making some turkey and cheese sliders on sweet Hawaiian roll bread. I'm going to show you that. I got some cilantro. Um, some breakfast sausage bread, almond milk creamer, pancake mix for the kids, string cheese for the kids, wheat tortilla wraps, seasoned fries for the kids, eggs, <laughs> butter, and then here is where we start to see some of the cool things that I had never seen them before and I'm excited to try. Um, this is a dip uh, made out of, it's vegan, gluten free and all that. Um, it's made out of cashew and almonds so I'm interested to see how this is gonna taste really interesting but yeah so that was one and then I also found brownie batter dessert hummus they also had vanilla and I can't remember another one as well I think it was like sugar cookie or something um I thought this was really cool I can't wait to try this uh, I'll, let, I'll let you guys know how it tastes but I'm really excited to try that um, some mango nectar, some coffee, orange juice, and then we got the taco shells, some garlic bread to have with the pasta, some favorites, these are like Cheez-Its, and then I am a sparkling water, seltzer water fanatic, so got myself some of those in lemon lime and then white grape. Some Vienna sausages because I like to make those on nights when I really just don't feel like cooking or I don't know what to make. and. I make yellow rice the Spanish way with some sofrito and add some of this in there. Super good. Some um, tomato sauce that's or sazon. Uh, I bought. I picked up some cream of chicken and cream of mushrooms. You can never go wrong with those. Those are like some staple items. Um, some cream cheese. I picked up these chia seeds because I'm going to be making my own chia seed yogurt with almond milk and I will be filming that as well. So it's, it'll be my first time. I'm really excited. Um, I just have to pick up one more ingredient that they did not have at Aldi's. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Shells and cheese. Um, some fish sticks. I bought some cauliflower crust roasted vegetable pizza. I found some cauliflower crackers also, so I'm excited to try these as well. Um, I bought yeah, I bought these for the kids here for a lazy night, of course. <laughs> some chicken broth. I found some. They have like different broths now too at Aldi's, and so I got this miso 
broth. I really like to have this when I go to an Asian restaurant, so um, I'll let you guys know how that tasted as well. Picked up some tomato basil soup, um, and then just some seasonings here. I uh, picked up some tahini because I'm gonna have, I have cucumber in my fridge, so I'm gonna have some of this with cucumbers and lemons juice squeezed over it. So. <laughs> I'm excited for that. Then on this side, we have our family pack of chicken breasts that I will clean and cut up for the different meals and separation for the different meals that I'm going to be making today. I bought some, this is like steak, carne asada, thin type meat for, um, I'm gonna be making those probably with tacos. And then some ground beef. I found this at Aldi, which I had never seen before and I thought it was pretty cool as well. So it's like a bean and they flavor it and it's supposed to be like a crunchy like satisfying snack like I guess like a chip or I don't know what you can compare this to once I try it I will let you guys know that as well apples lemons here's a sweet Hawaiian bread for the sliders some coconut water some almond flour for when I want to you know do different things like breaded chicken or something I also found this which I thought was really cool because um, it, I guess it's supposed to be like the Kodiak brand, um, but it was way less. Um, I will post the price below, but it, yeah, for the for the special items that I found at Aldi, I'll post those prices below, not of the whole thing. Um, but yeah, this was way cheaper than the Kodiak brand, so I'm gonna. I'm pretty sure it'll taste just as good. But yeah, I was excited about that. And then I picked up some Elevation protein bars also for those days when I'm on the go. I'm trying to um, plan all my meals and cook everything so that we can minimize the eating out. All right, that's my haul for today for Aldi. And I'm gonna go ahead and put these groceries away before you know they've been out for a little bit. Um, I, I bought a lot of this stuff and you see, I mean, it was a lot and I only spent $170, which I think is really good for my family as compared to going to other supermarkets that we have out here in North Carolina. So um, I'm excited to sit. I already had planned all the meals, obviously, so I bought what I needed for them. I'm excited to film them. I hope it works out and that I can post it on here. Um, I also have a few other videos lined up coming soon a mixture of makeup lifestyle things um but yeah i hope you guys are having a great what's today today is wednesday is it wednesday yes it's wednesday oh my god i don't even know what day it is my mind I, my mind has been so like jacked up lately and i've today was like a high anxiety day hence my face <laughs> Um, I also didn't put any makeup on because I'm probably going to try and film another video makeup related later on tonight after the kids go to bed. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys had a better day than I did. Leave me some love, some positive vibes below. <laughs> All right. Love you guys. Don't forget, subscribe to my channel. There's going to be many different types of videos coming and I like to do giveaways here and there. Um, I did my first one recently on YouTube. Um, hopefully they'll get better with time, but um, I'm really, really excited to, to have my videos planned out ahead of time now instead of just like spur of the moment. Um, but yeah, thank you for supporting me. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the love. Hi, so this is just a quick update, but um, last night I did try the brownie batter and it was so delicious. I even had to put it to the test and my husband, who does not even really like any vegetables, um, nonetheless, he doesn't even like, I mean, if he doesn't like vegetables, he's not going to like hummus. Um, he tried it and he thought it was pretty good, but the ultimate was when I gave it to my kids. They loved it, they wanted more, so I gave them a little bit with some graham crackers and they ate it up. Um, it was really good. I, I haven't tried the, the salsa dip yet. I'm gonna try that maybe, if not today, tomorrow. Um, I also killed that white grape sparkling water. Oh my God, 55 cents. And it tastes like grape soda, but it's water. Um, that was good. And I wanted to taste something else. What else did I taste yesterday? I had the brownie batter, maybe that was it.
I feel like I tried something else, but I cannot remember for the life of me right now. But um, yes, the brownie batter was definitely a hit. I highly recommend it. It was really, really good. And it's a beautiful day out here in the Carolinas. Um, I'm sitting out here soaking up the sun and the beautiful weather. It has a nice little breeze. I'm out here with my dog. Um, I, I know that when I did my haul yesterday, I don't know if anyone else noticed, but um, there were some vegan items within, like, I had meats and stuff. Like, I'm trying to eat healthy, but that doesn't mean that my whole family is going to jump on my bandwagon. Like, they still want to eat normal things. So, obviously, I had to get stuff for them and some stuff for me. And I'm not completely vegan or anything, but I don't really eat that, like, I don't really eat as much meat. And eventually I'm gonna like slowly just maybe wean myself off of it and try to just be more plant-based um but it's just an attempt I'm trying uh but yeah so that's why I had a mixture of <laughs> all those different types of items have a wonderful day